Alright, so what is going on and welcome back to another video on the channel today. We're going to be covering a topic which is quite popular at the moment, a lot of people are talking about this. And Cypher PK did also make a video on this like one day ago. So basically there is actually a way to play the old versions of Fortnite and you can even watch the old live events as well. So you can go back to any older season from chapter 1 and you can just free roam around the map, explore all the old POIs, you know, Tilted Towers, Loot Lake, all of that type of stuff. And it's just going to bring back a lot of nostalgia. Now, as I mentioned, Cypher PK made a video on this. He was exploring all the older locations, roaming around the map, and a lot of people were wondering how he actually did this. People thought he was maybe hacking, but it was literally just this software called Rift. And this is unfortunately only on PC, but you can download this software and you can play the older versions of Fortnite by downloading the older patches. Now Epic Games actually said they're fine with this as long as it is single player and you're not using any cosmetics. Uh, you can't use items from the battle pass or the item shop so you will just be a default skin and that is what the software is set to. It's just single player so you can't play with other people and you can't use any cosmetics so Epic Games are actually okay with this and you cannot get banned for it. You also won't get banned because it is run locally meaning it's not connected to the Epic Games servers so it is fine to do it but obviously you just need to follow the steps carefully and make sure you're doing it correctly. Now you can go back and download any version of Fortnite so you can go back and download Chapter 1, Season 5, you know 5.0 or 4.0, 3.0 whatever download you want to you know, get you can go back and download it which obviously does take quite a lot of storage but obviously if you have a PC with a lot of storage then you can download a few of these patches, play the patch and then delete it once you're done with it, download a different patch and just you know explore the older versions of Fortnite, bring back a lot of memories which it definitely will especially with the old locations. As I mentioned downloading these versions do take a lot of storage on your PC so if you was to download version 5.0 for chapter 1 season 5 it would take a lot of storage but obviously once you're done with it just delete it and move on to the next one. You could probably download a maximum of around 3 versions at a time and then just delete them once you're done. So for example if you download patch 2.0 to go back to chapter 1 season 2 you can play that then delete it and download maybe 3.0 afterwards just to maintain you know your storage because as I mentioned it will get filled up quickly because you know these downloads are probably like 10 gigabytes each so it will take a while to download especially if your Wi-Fi is not the best it might take a bit longer but you can download them and play the old versions. Now I did briefly mention watching old live events which is actually possible with this so those are the two main things you can do with this server so you can only free roam around the map by yourself and watch the old live events as I mentioned there's no multiplayer so you can't play with your friends you can only free roam the map by yourself which is still pretty good as I mentioned it brings back a lot of nostalgia so in terms of the old events if you was to download patch 9.40 for example this would take you back to season 9 and this would be the download for the robot versus monster event so you can do that if you wanted to rewatch that which in my opinion was definitely one of the best live events we've ever had as I mentioned I think it was season 4 with the rocket events so you can download the patch for that which I'm not sure exactly what patch it was but you could just look it up and download that patch to rewatch the old rocket event which was actually the first ever live event in Fortnite so you know, it's quite an important one if you want to rewatch that. Um, it's definitely very nostalgic to a lot of people, especially if you just started playing in that season. You know, it's, it just brings back a lot of memories. Now, as of right now, only Chapter One works to download, so you won't really be able to download any like Chapter Two seasons, like Chapter Two Season One, which isn't really a big deal because you know if you're able to play like Season Two, Three, Four, Five from Chapter One, I don't think anyone's going to choose any Chapter Two season to go back and play um, if you have those options. So you can go back and play any season and any patch. Now, as I mentioned the software is called Rift and I haven't done it since I don't really use PC but you are able to do this now as I mentioned just PC it's not available on console or anything like that but it is free to use I believe and obviously you won't get banned for it because Epic Games are okay with it. Now if you do actually want to do this there are probably tutorials to it on YouTube. I don't think it's really that complicated but obviously if you want to set it up and do it there are tutorials on YouTube so you can look that up and make sure you follow the steps carefully so you are doing it correctly. That's pretty much all the information we have to cover in today's video so if you did enjoy it don't forget to drop a like on it, leave a comment down below what are your thoughts on this because a lot of people are really hyped around this especially for the people who have already quit playing the game like a lot of people are coming back downloading this and just jumping on the old version just for one final time and you know having one final trip on the old map because if I was to do this I would definitely go to places like Moisty Maya, Tilted Towers, Loot Lake you know just all those old locations that you know bring back so much nostalgia. But yeah, as I mentioned, subscribe if you're new, turn on notifications, I'll see you in the next video, peace out.